It was Christmas time at Captain Shreve, but Christmas spirit could not be seen. The halls were dark, the halls were gloomy, even with Christmas break looming. So two students set out to make a difference, hoping that they could save Christmas. Me and Carter, the school is just feeling really down lately. Like, I just, it's so close to Christmas and there's just no Christmas spirit. I know, I agree. Like, it's just so bland. Like, there's nothing. Yeah. We gotta do something about it. Yeah. What, we, what can we do? Uh, I don't know. We could maybe, we could sing? Could sing. Whenever you sing, Christmas joy is bound to fall. I think I know some people that would sing with us. Let's do it. That was pretty good. I mean, I, I feel the spirit of the school a lot. I mean, yeah, it was a great start, but we got to keep going. You got any more ideas? I got a good idea, actually. Uh, it wouldn't work. Can you give Mr. Sylvia a Christmas gift? That's an awful idea. Why would we ever do that? It's better than your singing idea. You know what? I'm done. This is stupid. That's, that's it. You're not leaving this time. Oh, that's it. It's over, Matt. I have the high ground now. Screw this. I'm gone. Where are you, Christmas? Why can't I find you? Why have you gone away? Can't I hear music play? My world is changing. I'm rearranging. Does that mean Christmas changes too? Hey, man. Sorry about the fight. Me too, man. I was being jerk. I mean, we gotta save Christmas together. It can't be a single effort. I know just how to do it. And Christmas was saved. Everyone remembered what happened that day. Shreve had a new Christmas spirit. A walk through the halls and you could hear it. As students went home, they did a double take. Merry Christmas to all, said Mr. Sylvie. And to all, a good break.